It's about 5.55 a.m. here in Bowling Green, Kentucky. Headed out right now for the Camping World Truck Series race at Eldor Speedway. Camping World. World Headquarters. National Corvette Museum. It's the Corvette assembly plant here in Bowling Green, Kentucky. Second trip to uh, Eldor, and pretty pumped for it. Went to the World 100 last year, got to sit in turn two. Actually, turn one, uh, had a blast there. Um, today, my brother and I will be sitting in turn three, uh, a couple rows up. Pretty excited about that, need to get some goggles. So we're about uh, 30 minutes away from the track right now. Uh, practice from the uh, morning session just finished up a little while ago. Uh, blue skies, a lot of clouds, but uh, no rain expected. So uh, should be a pretty good show. Who's gonna win today? I'm gonna say Onion Head. It's probably gonna be Austin Dillon, but I'm gonna say Onion Head. So uh, this is roughly where we sat last fall for the World 100. Uh, first time here at Eldora, it was pretty cool experience. Yeah. 
Again, that concrete area in front of the main grandstands, behind the catch fence, behind the flag stand, that is a no standing zone at all times. And concession stands, behind the main grandstands, the immediate building is an area where a lot of congestion can occur. If you're walking to or from the turn one area, we ask you to walk behind the restrooms and concession stands. Daryl 
into the event 10 in the NASCAR Camping World Truck Series point standings. Out of Welcome, North Carolina, in the American Ethanol Chevy Silverado, the 39 is Austin Dillon. Kyle Larson, two years ago, swept the Saturday portion of Fort Crown Nationals in Eldora. He won the USAC Midgets. He won the USAC Sprints. He won the USAC Silver Crown Series. And he'll cross the stripe, his first lap, 23rd on the grid, Kyle Larson. For $5 million in grants to top charities nationally, and they raise and donate funds to help care for children dying from the series. Modified regular J.R. Hefner for the second spot as Ken Schrader tries to make a break away at the front of the field. The outside lane, right up against the outside wall, has been finished. Nice, nice. 